you know, I spend a lot of my time talking to people that are considering making a big career change. They're considering starting their own business. And particularly my work focuses on franchise ownership. And so many of the people that I speak with are miserable and fed up in their corporate career track. And, and in many cases, they've been thinking about making this change of going into business for themselves for many, many years. And they've never taken that leap. They've never bet on themselves. And, you know, there's a lot of ways that the the reasons manifest, but, you know, usually it's tied to fear of the unknown, fear of failure, combination of both of those things. And, you know, I wanted to share this clip from Dana White, because I think it is some of the most powerful advice that anyone considering making this type of a decision uh, you know, going into business for themselves could ever hear. So listen to this clip from Dana White. If you wake up in the morning and it kills you to get in the shower and put your clothes on, get in that car and drive to your job, you hate it so bad, get out. You are in the wrong place. You don't belong there. I, I'm telling you, you don't belong there. And you know it. You know you don't belong there. You're just scared to make that move. So, that so, move so, is scary. So how do you make the move? Like, do you put it in your wrist? Do you, you walk out? You walk out. You walk out. Let me tell you what, when you start planning on doing something, it's like anybody in this room who has a kid. It's never the right time to have a kid. You never have enough money. You never, it's never the right time. But then you have a baby and it all works out. You make it work. It's the same thing with this. Life is very short, way too short to be miserable and get up and drive to a miserable job that you hate every day. It's just life's too short for that. Man, that, that hit home for me. It's scary. To, to make a move like that. And there's a million reasons why you could say, hey, the time will be better down the road. I'll have more money. I'll have more experience. But the fact of the matter is, as Dana points out here, life is short. None of us know how much time we have. And it's way too short to spend this huge chunk of your time, all the time that you spend working, doing something that you're miserable doing, doing something that doesn't fulfill you. You know, there's so many studies that show that people perform at the highest levels when they're doing something that they're passionate about, when they're doing something that is exciting to them and something that fires them up. And so if you are feeling like you're just kind of coasting through life and a job that you're miserable in and you're not being truly fulfilled, I really encourage you to take Dana's advice. And I'm not saying jump off the, the deep end without thinking about it. I'm not saying walk out and quit your job today, but really take the time to explore different options that are out there. You know, there are thousands and thousands of people every single year that make this transition into business ownership for themselves. My wife and I have done it and it was scary and it was hard. And there were a million reasons that we could have said, hey, we're going to do this one day, but not yet. The timing's not right. And I can look back now and, and very honestly tell you it was by far the best professional decision that we ever made. And our life has improved dramatically on every single front since we made that decision to bet on ourselves and buy our first franchise business seven years ago. So, you know, I'll leave you with this in closing one of the best pieces of advice I ever got, and it's helped me navigate some of these big life-changing decisions that were scary. And that advice was, Wes, you've got to start thinking of fear in the terms of being more afraid of regret than you are of failure. When I shifted to that mindset, it changed the way I looked at everything. And I think that's Dana White's point here is life is short. You don't want to get to the end of your life and have all these regrets. You know, you're not going to remember every single thing that you tried and, and failed out or everything you tried and didn't, you know, succeed at the first time. You are going to remember the things that you wish you would have tried, the, the things that you wish you would have taken a bet on yourself with. So, you know, I hope this motivates you the way it's motivated me. If, if business ownership is something that you've been thinking about, I'd love to talk with you, explain how franchise ownership could be a, a great avenue for you to make that transition into business for yourself. So anyways, love this clip. Just wanted to share it with you guys and uh, I hope it motivated you the way it did me.